Kelly Hagen and Anna in Tartaglio are summer interns in the University of Kentucky's Horse Pasture Evaluation Program. This is a typical day for them, heading out to a horse farm in Kentucky to see what they can find in the farm's pasture. Their evaluation provides farm owners and managers an in-depth pasture analysis with the goal of keeping horses safe and healthy while increasing the farm's efficiency and productivity. Um, I've been with horses for about 15 years and rather than working you know, in a barn all summer long, I thought why not do something that had a little bit of research that wasn't just you know, hands-on with the horses, was more science-based. And when I got here, I really thought that there was only one species of grass. And so they come and they show me all these species of grass and my mind was blown. And I didn't realize there was so much to know. And that got me really interested. Students like in Tartaglio and Hagen can apply to the program from any U.S. college or university. That was the case with Hagen, who is a senior at Asbury University in Kentucky. She is a biology major studying the growth of alfalfa for her senior research project. In Tartaglio is a junior equine science major from Pennsylvania. So a typical day for us, our team will head out to a farm that um, we've decided to evaluate and we will go through the fields and we drop uh, PVC pipe grids and we will look at the species within the grid with the species composition. So we'll look for certain types of grasses, weeds, um, clover, any bare soil, and we estimate the percentages that we see. And based on the number of acres within the field, um, we will drop a certain amount of grids. And then we also take samples of tall fescue. Crystal Lay is the coordinator for the pasture evaluation program and works with the students as well as the farm owners and managers. Um, a lot of them want to learn about, about horse farms. They want to see some horse farms and that kind of thing. Many of them don't have a great interest in forage production when they start with us, but they often leave with a much bigger interest in it. Um, they enjoy getting to meet students from other universities, um, and they enjoy getting to see the research side of, of a lot of the different things that we do. University of Kentucky Forage Extension Specialist Ray Smith and Crystal Lay train the interns in forage and weed identification. Farms pay a fee to have their pastures evaluated by the students, but Smith says they are not competing with consultants who do the same work. But we're also very conscious that there, there are other um, organizations and, and consultants that do work on horse pastures. So we don't want to compete directly with those. Um, we want to let private industry do what it does very well. Um, so we look at our program as providing good advice, also being a very good from an educational standpoint in the student training. Once the analysis is complete, students present the results along with Crystal Lay to farm owners, managers, and staff. Students are paid an hourly wage for their internship, which typically starts at the end of the spring semester and goes all summer. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, Food, and Environment, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.